Hi, boys and girls. Uh, we're back at South by Southwest, and we're just, you never know who's going to pop over to the awesome 101X Day Party and uh, churches. Some some of two, churches have stopped by this Two afternoon. out of three churches. That's not so bad. Yeah. Where, where, where'd the third church go? Um, the third church is at home because it's not really an official band trip. You guys so. have kind of been bouncing in and out for South by Southwest. Well, yeah, yeah. We had a thing earlier. For Interactive, week, right? Actually, uh, during Interactive, and believe it or not, I'm here mostly for fun. Well, yeah. d didn't someone do a DJ set here recently? Um, I guess I was here last night for the Laneway Festival party. Okay. I was hosting, whatever that means. Oh, very cool. I didn't do a whole lot. Um, and That's then the I best had part a of hosting. I do it all the time. Morning, so <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that was rude. Um, <laughs> no, that's quite all right. But yeah, so technically I had two work-related things to do. And then you're just here for the banter because you love tunes. I do enjoy music. <laughs> and uh, I'm... Well, can we talk about tacos? No. Yeah, we can talk all about tacos, all, man. All South by interviews turn to tacos now. Yeah, we're, we've been trying to figure out some Tex-Mex spots for you guys to hit. While, well, at least for you to hit. And you were saying Torchies is kind of your your Torchies your go-to thing, man. Yeah, which which one do you get? The Republican, um, the Democrat, the, the what's the, one, park? the sausage? The like I think it's, it's just the, a the piece Republican. Of I think it's a Republican. Yeah, yeah. The, the brush fire is awesome. See, I know all of them, dude. The yeah. Diablo sauce is the bomb. Mm. We could go on, and we were talking about queso too. Have you ever outside of Texas found queso that you enjoyed? Yes. Really? There's Tell a me. place in Los Angeles called Home State, which I okay. think is like an ex-Texas thing or maybe okay. guys from Texas came and like started it and it's very very good okay because otherwise other places it's just like a cheese sauce yeah I don't want a cheesy soup it needs to have the spice and it, it needs to be light enough but like yeah yeah There's it needs to give thing. you cancer of some sort yes. or <laughs> in order to <laughs> destroy brain cells something like that I understand I completely such understand such exchange you know what you're doing well, while you're here having fun are you going to actually get out and see music and if so who who is it that you're trying to see while you're in town for South by um I saw some good things last night. I saw a Scottish band called The Ninth Wave. I like a lot. I think that they could do something really cool. They're they're very very new. Is that someone that you were looking forward to, or yeah. that you just kind of stumbled upon? No, but I seem to like stumble upon. This is the thing about South by. Never make a plan. I agree 100%. Just, Always the best shows I've see. seen. Yeah. Every time the show that you were standing in line and it was too long, and then you had to stumble next door because you wanted a cold beer or a drink, yeah. and then you walk in, a band comes on, and you're just blown away. That's how. All that's, of my favorite bands. That's the spirit of South by. Yeah, man. So I'm just trying to. I'm just Especially trying the to drinking that. part and the taco part. Sure thing. And how about you? You gonna get out and see some shows, or are you just kind of well, taking? Well, I guess easy? this is my last. This isn't really work, but it's the last work-related thing of the day. Cool. Um, but last night I saw a band called Charlie Bliss, who I really loved. Um, I've been listening to them for a little while, but I hadn't seen them live. And the singer's voice live is like. It's, it's always the best so when someone exceeds your expectations when you see yeah. them live, because a, a lot of people will wonder, well. Is that are they that talented or is it is it done in the mix? Did they fix it in post? Or it made me feel like I should go home and rehearse. Ah, so yeah, I, I was like, that was good. You're doing alright. I was right. like, she's so good. I need to go home and practice. I think you're gonna be okay. I think the best music either makes you wanna quit or start a band. <laughs> you can't figure out which. Um, but tonight, King Princess and Lizzo back to back. It's <sighs> Lizzo. Yeah, people have been talking about King Princess. Someone mentioned uh, I can't remember. Oh, uh, uh, Billy Eilish was supposed to be doing like a surprise show somewhere, and you know, and uh, but every year it's like oh, but, uh, Daft Punk is playing the uh, uh, taco yeah. place in a, in on a the trash east side. Like, yeah, the you yeah. haven't heard. Tom York's going to be hosting. <laughs> we should totally go. We're going to have to call a friend. Let me text a friend. He might know how to get in. Yeah, That's how it is every next year. Next thing you're in like a car park ten miles out of town. <laughs> yeah. No There's hope of getting back to your hotel. Yeah. Yeah. Just some guy peeing next to you for no reason, <laughs> yeah. right by the bathroom, dude. You can go inside. Uh, yeah, that's that's usually how my South by winds up yeah. at the end of the night. <laughs> I try to go home earlier than that nowadays. Well, you guys do have some music uh, being set up, although not just yet, but soon. New music, yes. Um, new. Well, a feature song came out last week, mm -hmm. so that's that's the new music. Album? Um, no. No, just just the features. No, it's like someone's been spreading fake fake news. We don't. I'm like, do you have it? Because I don't have it. I'm like, yeah, oh, the Marshmallow so Collab. Yes, okay. so that came out uh, last Friday. And, uh, yeah, I guess it's cool because we don't do that many features or collaborations, really. That when we have done it, it's been when we've been lucky enough to have people sing on our records. Right. So, yeah, it was kind of a cool kind of postal service -y vibe where we could we had a tune and then we sent it to him and then we kind of bounced it back and forth till we got to the end. So that's kind of the thing right now is the, the collabs. But I, I have to say I really like them because it harkens back to me being a kid and, you know, watching Happy Days and Laverne and Shirley would pop. Like, I know this sounds cheesy, but it was just cool to me that these worlds that I, these two worlds that I enjoy would collide. And that's just kind of cool to me yeah. because it's just what, what's, you know, two great things that I love, put them together. It's even better. It's like comic books. You like, know where they yeah. do like feature comic books? Where exactly. They cross over that editions? was the best. It's great. Because yeah. it made everything right.
made yeah. you feel good about yourself. Working with him has been really fun as well. He's a, he's a good kid. Is he? Yeah, he's uh, cool. I'm assuming super talented. Otherwise, very, very talented. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. It's great to see the song. People are really taking it on. And well, well he's great. he's done all right for himself so far. He's doing all right. Yeah. <laughs> I think you guys will be all right. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be good. Well, guys, thank you so much for sitting down. Thanks. Don't want to take up too thank much you of your time. Got to go eat all the queso. Yeah, we got to go I get leave, some queso, so. tacos, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But anyway, South by Southwest. We're in the green room, by the way. You never know who's gonna show up next. You never know. It's blue, technically. <laughs> <laughs>